Good evening, everyone. My name's Heath Haskins, Code Prime, and welcome back to another Nino Kuni episode. What is this? Episode 13, I think? Maybe? Uh, who cares? <laughs> I love this game. Uh, so, let's see. Last time we left off, we had just um, fought the nightmare, fixed the heart. They're, they're doing great. They're now lovey birds. Let's head back and go find... What was her name? Myrtle? I don't know if skipping makes me run faster whenever I'm already running, but oh well. I have a feeling that dog's gonna come into play sometime. Nope, oh, hello. Nope, 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 that. Just, there we go. Whew. <sighs> Mommy and Daddy's over. Oliver, all right. what is it? Well, uh, if my father sees you, he'll. Myrtle, come with me. Huh? You can go outside now. You're not sick anymore. I... I can't, Oliver. Just thinking about going out there gives me goosebumps. Agoraphobia. Myrtle. Oh. Go on out and play, Myrtle. But... Father... Sweetheart. I'm so sorry. I don't know what happened to me. I wasn't there when you were sick, when you needed me, and I was fighting with your mother the whole time. I guess maybe the thing that was keeping you closed up in here, maybe it was me. Father. You were scared somewhere deep down that if you went away, even for a little while, your mother and I would lose the one thing keeping us together, that we, we wouldn't be a family anymore. I'm right, aren't I? That's why you... Why you were... Something deep inside you wouldn't let you leave the house. <laughs> Father, I... It's all right, sweetheart. Your mother and I, it's gonna be okay. <laughs> Father! <laughs> please, Myrtle. Please forgive me. Oh, I do. Daddy, I do. Are those tears, Bunting? Huh? No, they're not. So much for you being honest. Uh, Oliver? Hmm? I'm going to try. I'm going to go outside. Will you come with me? Cue dramatic what? music. I'm sorry, Trippy has a way of just ruining it. <clears throat> well, if you're gonna see outside, you gotta have your eyes open. There you go. Ah! ah! No, I'm just kidding. I'm just. I'm sorry. Sorry. Bad timing. Riddle. <laughs> I did it, Oliver. I did it. I'm outside. I'm outside. <laughs> Oh, that's beautiful. <laughs> Oliver, thank you so much. Yay. I'm so happy for you, Myrtle. <clears throat> okay, I'm going to try and get her voice. <clears throat> I couldn't have done it without you, Oliver. I'm going to go outside every day from now on. I'll go to school again. I'll meet new people. I'll buy new clothes. It's so strange. I was so scared to come outside, but now I feel brave. I feel like I could do anything. Listen to her, man. All of a sudden, she's gotten more courage than you could ever shake a stick at. I can feel it from all the way over here. Over by here. She does, huh, Mr. Drippy? There's something in Al Mamoon. There's someone in Alma Moon who could really use some of that courage. Nice thinking, Ollie boy. A drop of Myrtle's newfound bravery is just what needs to is just what we need to kickstart the young Ether's recovery. <clears throat> is something the matter, Oliver? Myrtle, I uh I know a girl who's just like you, and she's going through something terrible. Huh? You're so brave. I wanted to know if you would let me give some of your courage to the this girl to help her and to help her family. 
Of course, but how do we do that? We use magic, and I know just the spell. Magic? You're an interesting boy, Oliver. But sure, go ahead. All right, close your eyes. Like this? Now wait a second. We didn't make anybody else close their eyes. Uh, that's okay. Let's see. Let's use the gateway spell on her. Just poof. <laughs> just, yeah, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Boom. Bravery. A stout study for some fearlessness. <clears throat> you obtained some courage. So it's green. It feels warm. My heart, it feels warm. That means the magic worked. Thank you so much, Myrtle. Now my friend can finally start to get better. I'm glad. Righto, Ollie boy. We've got some courage to deliver, ain't it? Let's get going. Sure. Myrtle, I have to go now. Wish your friend the best of luck for me, won't you, Oliver? I hope she gets better soon. Thank you, Myrtle. I will. See you soon, Oliver. Okay, so now we just... Uh, okay, there's no stars, so let's teleport. Boom! Gateway. It calls zero magic. Which is funny, because that's a very powerful spell. You'd think it'd cost at least some magic points, right? Just be zipping in between galaxies. Different planes of existence. Sorry, that's a conversation for another time. Let's go! Hello, everyone. Clap, clap, clap. I give you a great deal on ba um, bananas. They're not bananas. They're uh, ba babanas. Babanas. Hey, there's the racing boy. Hello. There you are. All right, let me talk to you first. Here she is. Oliver. Huh? Tidy. Just like I thought. We've opened her heart back up. You can mend it for her now. Don't worry. Oh, sorry. Don't worry. This will only take a moment. I'm going to give you some of Myrtle's courage, okay? Yep. Her eyes are wide open. Just fire that courage and Bob's your uncle. Or Robert's your brother's... Uh, brother's... No. Robert's your... Mother's brother? <laughs> Get it? Bob's your uncle. Same thing. Uh, give heart. <laughs> what if we put the wrong kind in there? Give her enthusiasm. <laughs> Don't mess this up, code. Boom! Ooh, it's sparkly. Ah! What is this? What is this? It didn't do that before. Where am I? What happened? It was Shadar. He stole a piece of your heart. My heart? Is it you, Esther? Is it really you? Oh, my dear daughter. Father. Oh, forgive me, my child. <laughs> <laughs> you were robbed of your courage. But I... I have only myself to blame for the loss of my own. Oliver, it is you who taught me this. You have my thanks. You're welcome, Mr. Rashad. I will join you in the fight against Shudar. The day will soon come when the clarion rings out across the land once more. The clarion? Oh, it's an old story from way back, that is. Back when the world was at peace, like. The three kings of our world combined their skills and knowledge to create a flute that symbolized the great peace. The sound of this flute came to represent the unity of the nations of the world. How long is it now since the call of the Clarion was heard? Not since the Three Kings got into a right old potch and fell out, I heard. It's up to us. The Clarion will ring out again and we will be the ones to play it. <laughs> Very well, daughter. Let us do our best. Let us help Oliver in his fight. Thank you so much, Mr. Rashad, sir. Okay, so <clears throat> Esther has got an, a British accent, but that same girly voice. So I'm going to try... Please don't make fun. <laughs> <clears throat> I'm 
Let me come with you, Oliver. I want to help you fight Shaddaa. I have a familiar to help me, just like you. Here, boy. What the heck? <laughs> it's a chicken. Wow, you can fight familiar with familiars too, Esther? Indeed she can. Esther's talent lies in training and handling of familiars. <clears throat> wow, <laughs> I, I didn't realize how much Mr. Drippy and uh, the, the dad sound like. <clears throat> so, she's more of a familiar keeper than a wizard, is it? Fair enough. Useful folks to have around, they are. <laughs> <laughs> this is my drang drango. This is my drango. His name is Gogo. Say hello, Gogo. I I, did, I messed up the voice. Esther and her familiar have joined the party. <clears throat> Tidy. Now that that's settled, let's go get down to business. Remember what young Oliver came here for, ain't it, Rashad? Mister Drippy. I <laughs> I do. You wish to learn the arts of the sages, do you not? Yes, sir. Then you will need these spells. Doo -doo 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 -doo. You received a page describing the puppet string spell. Doo -doo 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 -doo. You received a page describing the secret ingredient spell. Doo -doo 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 -doo. You received a page describing the magic lamp spell. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Oh my, my gosh. You received a page describing the pulse spell. Thank you, Mr. Richard. Sir? I am satisfied you do not lack the determination required. You came here for another world to face Shadar after all. Y you knew about me being from another world, I mean? Huh? It was your actions that revealed your origins to me. You healed Esther when I could not. Which told me that you must have helped her soulmate in an other world. And only one who who called the world home could have done such a thing. Wow. <clears throat> okay, hold on. She's got that accent. Wow. So Oliver is from another from one of the other worlds you told me about, Father. And he was the one wizard who saved me. Yes, it's strange. It feels like I've met you in a dream or something. Oliver? It seems there are things that only one such as you can do. You may be able to help our world. You shall have my aid. Thank you, sir. I won't let you down. I will beat Shadar. Perhaps, but you will need much training first. Without complete command of the magical arts, you cannot hope to defeat him. The four great sages could not overcome the dark... The Dark Jinn. <clears throat> For a mere boy to do so will require more than enthusiasm alone. <clears throat> what you what are you thinking? He's going to need to cram a wow of experience under his belt. Heck of a short time, ain't he? Okay. Indeed he is. This kind of experience offered by the trials of sieges. Oliver, you must undertake them. Trials? Where do I take these trials? In the north of the desert, at the Temple of Trials. <laughs> of course. The Temple of Trials? You mean... I do. The home of the Supreme Sage, Master of Familiars. You, too, must to learn. have much to learn, Esther. Only those with Supreme Sage's blessing are permitted to open the doors of the temple. I will accompany you. Thank you, Father. You're the great and... Wait. You'll be great at the trials, Oliver. I know you will. Thank you, Esther. And thank you, Mr. Richard. Sir? Richard is now traveling with you. Oh my goodness. Our party just, like, grew exponentially. And we can't even see him. We're just hanging out. Okay. Can we get some of these banana nuts to go? We didn't get our banana split. Okay, fine. Hello. Should I take from her? I don't know what she's got. Welcome, welcome. Uh, home, beautiful. Hope you update. Outfit. Neato. Uh, new cape, huh? Ollie boy, we're not here for a flipping shopping trip. Who do you think we are? Made of money. Oh, a fairy. A very stylish, uh, st 
stylish little fellow you are, too. Do you have something here that would suit you down to the ground? Let me see now. Oh, yes, perfect. You reckon? Yeah, I see what you mean. I'd look business in like that. Mr. Trippy. Oh, oh, uh, sorry, Ollie boy. I got a bit carried away in it. You've got to hand, hand it to her. The girl can sell. Roll up, roll up fine fabrics to put a smile on your face and spin in your, a spring in your step. Look at the locket glowing. Oh, sorry, look at the locket glowing. And I reckon you know why. That lady's got more enthusiasm than a school, a school full of six-year-olds. <laughs> nice. Uh, excuse me, ma'am. I have something to ask you. I, I think I already have... Okay, let's just kind of spin through this. There we go. Yeah, we already we already have some enthusiasm, so... We'll keep going. Doop, doop, doop. Whoa. I bet that's enthusiasm, too. We're, we're just... We're gonna go. We're gonna go. I'm here on a mission. We've got 15 minutes to do so. And let's get... Wait. This is... That's not the way. This way. Whee! Back out to the desert. Oh, it's Hartmann. Hartmann! There we go. Oh my goodness. A party is huge. This is the first time I've been out of Alma Moon in ages, Oliver. <laughs> and you sure do look happy about it. Esther, the purpose of this journey is to take the trials. You're not wrong, man. This ain't a flippin' day trip, you know. Get moving. All right, all right. Lead the way. That's the spirit. Now then, let's... Hang on a minute. Did that sand over there just move? It flippin' did, man. It's a monster, ain't it? Right then, Ollie boy. Since you're going to be fighting with Esther from now on, I'd better teach you some new moves, ain't it? Ready, you two? Yes. You know, flipping in, in between like five different characters we can is, do this. is freaking me out a little bit. Not gonna lie. <clears throat> now you and Esther can fight together, man. Double trouble, tidy. Now that the two of you can pick who leads when the battle starts, press L1 or L... Wait, L1 or R1? Ooh. Why don't you give it a go? Go on, pick Esther. Esther, leave it to me. <laughs> nice. Here goes Esther. Here goes Esther. Here goes Esther. Nice. Okay. So now I choose her, right? Now Esther. <clears throat> now Esther's in charge instead. See, she's what you call the leader now, and the leader can boss everyone around. See the tactics command down there? Yes. Pick it and you can tell your buddies what you want them to do. Easy peasy. Now to change the leader mid-battle, just press the L1 followed by a little tap on the old up or down key. Now get up there and enjoy being the gruesome twosome. Okay. So, Oliver just threw out Jess Jack. I'm gonna throw out mine. Oh my goodness. Okay, this, this is very confusing. Hold on, so can I switch over to him? Yes, that is very confusing. We won! Wow. Okay, wait, so does that mean I have two sets of experience points now? No, they still all share the same gold and the same experience. <clears throat> Fine work, Oliver. Your magical abilities are indeed impressive. As is your rapport with your familiar, daughter. <laughs> I do my best. You know, Oliver, I'd love to try fighting with your familiar sometime. Huh? You can do that? Of course. All you need to do is switch your familiars around. 
Just select Friends and Familiars from the main menu. Trust me, it's really easy. Just select a familiar and press square, and then choose where you want them to go. Do that, and we can swap familiars. Gee, that's pretty neat. I had no idea. <laughs> you can control Dun Drong Drongo as well, uh, aka Gogo, if you like, Oliver. In fact, everybody can have a type of familiar that they get on especially well with. Use the type of familiar that's right for you, and their performance will be much better. Better. You can check what type of familiars you get along with well by selecting the friends and familiars from the main menu. Right, enough chit chat, you two. We need to get to the tri Temple of Trials, ain't it? Indeed. It's located northeast of the Shimmering Sands. I suggest we head there immediately. All right. Oh, sorry, that was Oliver. All right. Okay, let's get going. Oh, we're, we're just gonna. Uh, no, 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 run away, run away. Go around, go around, go around. Don't let him catch you. Don't let him catch you. Oh, that one's coming right for us, isn't he? Oh, gosh. Okay, fine. We'll run headlong into him. Sunshine and. Turbandit. Turbandit. Oh, I guess she's already attacking me. Okay, fine. Oh, wait, 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 wait. What are you doing? Get out there. Whoa! That was like an area of attack. And yes, Esther has got low... Like... Hold up. She does have her own attack bar. Or her own HP. And MP, so... I'm gonna have to watch out for two people's life now. Dang it. Alright. No, 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 no! Always turn into him. Turn into him. Turbanda A, Turbanda E, or B. Yep, let's go. That one did 24 damage. Did you just heal me? Dude, that was awesome. Good job, Coco. -Go. <laughs> Good job, Jason. You're now level 10. Way to be. You know, if you had your familiars just right with the experience points and stuff, you could probably... Um, oh gosh. How do I get up there? Oh, I gotta go in there, don't I? If you had all of your... Ooh, there's sparkly stuff. How do I get to the sparkly stuff? The Temple of Trials lies... Oh, sorry. The Temple of Trials lies just on the other side of the gorge. Perhaps this is a good place for a moment's respite? Flippin' Hackman, I'm glad you suggested that. I'm a forest fairy, me. My fairy suit ain't enough sandproof. We're stopping already? We're stopping already? But I could go on for ages yet. Really? Aren't you even a little tired? It's so hot. Hmm. You will endure far worse things in the Temple of Trials, Oliver. Gee, so the trials are pretty tough, huh? Indeed. That's why they must go that's why you must get some rest. I will keep watch, you will sleep. Stay close on the fire. The desert grows cold at night. All right, Mr. Richard, sir. Okay, so we're we're camping in the gorge. Is that right? Oliver? What is it, Esther? Why did you set out on this journey in the first place? Most people wouldn't dream of taking on someone like Shadar. Well, uh... It's my mom. I have to save her. Your mother? Uh, yeah. She... She died saving my life. But 
Mr. Drippy says there's a way to help her here in this world. So, you've come here to save your mother? Yeah, I guess. Wow. Huh? Doing all this for the sake of someone you love? I just think that's amazing. I wish I had as good a reason as you for making this journey. <sighs> oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean I wish that... It's okay. But... Shadar is incredibly powerful. He breaks the hearts of anyone who defies him. So no one dares to resist. And they say no one can defeat him. I know that. But... I have to. You have to try. Right? I... Yeah. It's so strange. You don't look powerful in the least. But somehow, I just know you can beat him. I wonder why. Th thanks. Anyway, enough of that. It's late. Okay. He ended that conversation kind of quick, just saying. Alright, here we go. <clears throat> Good morning, Oliver. Did you sleep well? Uh, not really. I guess I'm a little worried about the trials. Oh dear. Well, I hope you won't doze off in the middle of them. Though I have to say, I didn't sleep very well myself. I kept thinking about that girl, my other self. It's so strange. She's not like me at all, but I don't feel like she's a different person. Well, soulmates are funny like that, ain't it? Different, but the same. They're profound. There's profound. I said that wrong. There's profound. Anyway, we're taking the trials or what? Oliver, Esther, the temples of trials lie to the north, here. The tests that await you, there are unforgiving, but I have faith in you. Thank you, sir. Let's go, Oliver. I want to show you how brave I am, just like Myrtle did. The innocent goodness of heart and the great sage's daughter has unlocked the story, Wizard's Companion. Ooh, my other self. You obtained a new tale of wonder. Um, by the way, if you wanted to read the entire Wizard Compendium, Companion, whatever it's called, you can find a PDF version of it and download it. You know, onto your smartphone or tablet or whatever. This is so Pokemon. <laughs> oh, we are at 28 minutes, and there is no way I'm going to be able to, like, keep up with this. Uh, can we save in here? Um, let's see. We cannot save inside here. So, let's, let's head back out. I know, I know. You guys are like, oh, you got two minutes left, Code. Yeah, but I gotta, I gotta get going. So... Let's stop here and we'll save. Save a new data? Yes, please. Done. Thank you everyone for watching this episode of Mino Kuni with me, Heath Haskins, Code Primate. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe down below. Check out all the links in the description and uh, you can actually purchase your own copy from Walmart or Best Buy for the PlayStation 4, the PlayStation 3, the Nintendo Switch, and I think there's a, a PC version, um, but I don't have a link for that one. By the way, disclaimer, if you use those links, I get paid from those affiliates. Um, you don't have to use the links, but, you know, it's cool. I, I put them there just in case you wanted them. Love you guys very much. Have a great night. And we'll talk to you very soon. I'm Altman. Outro. <laughs> I tried to do it in Drippy's voice. That was horrible. Outro.